I'm really glad to see here all of you here. And now uh, we will start learning some great. Uh, you can use this both sides. It's up to you. You can use it for both ways. So, and I will explain you. This is our today's agenda. So first, I will explain you how to register to the websites. Then I will explain you how to find the games which is appropriate to your content. And the next thing which we are going to do is create a new games for your classes, for your levels. And then we will play with your, you can play with the these games with your students. So this is today's our agenda. So now time is to get to know with these websites. So we have to move to the Google. As you can see, we, we are seeing the Google page. You should go to the, any browser, any, you can even Yandex, you can use, doesn't matter. You have to use some kind of browser to lead you to these websites. Mm -hmm. One second. Just so now we are in the Google page. Yes. Uh, hello, everybody. Hello. Uh, we we are very happy to see you to see all of you again here, even if it is Sunday. You are eager to learn. Jahangir, I'm very sorry for being late, and it's good that you have already begun. But Jahangir, can you talk a little bit slowlier? Because some people are writing, uh, please, Jahangir, a little bit slowlier, okay? <laughs> yes. Okay, okay a little course. bit slowlier, yeah. And make mm -hmm. sure, guys, uh, uh, you have extra devices to practice, uh, which, is, um, which is being explained to you. If you don't have extra device, please quickly get it, okay, from your family members, and you will practice it simultaneously. Okay, Johan, get a little bit slowlier. You can continue. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yes, I will try to be, speak slowly and explain everything in detail. Now, if you are in the browser page, if you are in, in, in can be Yandex or it's anything, here or such things, you can search. You need engine. So this one you should write, let's learn about, first we'll learn about Kahoot, how to create the Kahoot and how to play it with your students. So for this, you have to write kahoot.com. Here I will show you uh, bigger letters, kahoot.com. And you should search. Here I wrote and you should search it. You should push and click the enter and you will see. Okay, here you will see the two options, kahoot.com and, and kahoot.it. Sometimes most teachers confuse with this because it is a bit different from each other. If you want to create, if you want to create some games, you should go to the kahoot.com. Okay, this is for creating games. This is for creating games and this one is for playing games. You should give this one to your students. Okay, I will explain it a bit more later on. So we have to go to the first to create the games. And for this, you should go to this site. And this is the Kahoot website. And as you can see, there's the, um, a lot of functions it has. And here you can see, and you can get to know with, web, with this website very popular it's becoming very popular these days and you you can and you should go to here should be sign up button and you should go to this spot button you should sign up and it asks you and here you can see that these things am i audible can you hear me okay so this is for email. If you want to write your email, email is different from Gmail, okay? You should write email here. We starting from Yandex or other, other apps or other things. And if you, if you have, if you are using Gmail, you can go to with Gmail or Microsoft or Google uh, apps. Doesn't matter which uh, platform you are using. So I strongly recommend you to use Google Gmails or you can have a mail or Yandex, you can write here. 
okay, for Yandex here, or Mailer for here. But if you are using the Google, you should go there. And it asks you to choose which account are you using. If you are using one account, it asks only one. So let's use this one. Mm -hmm. it's, it is directing us to the website. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's choose another one. So we are almost logging in. We have to go back. You, you, in this same, it will ask you something similar. And you should, I already have account. That's why I couldn't register it. And now I have to log in here. So we are now in the Kahoot. So uh, when you come, when you enter this, you will see this button. Uh -huh. You will see this page. Okay, I will explain this, what, what uh, functions this page has. So first, uh, first of all, uh, let's talk about here, you can find all your information. It's all about you, uh, your age, your interests, your plans, everything about you. And here, here you will find uh, all the Kahoot which you are going to create. And the panel about you can control the website. Okay, this is a very important panel. You can control the whole website and you can switch the, the pages with the help of this panel. So we'll learn about this, right? The home page. And here you can find all the best and all the new uh, Kahoot which are going to play uh, all over the world and very popular Kahoot games here you can find. And they are the top ones. Please look at the pay attention to this. This means uh, 84,000 times played with the pupils. It's very popular and it can be appropriate to your school or your classes. Here's this one and this one also. And you can discover uh, other Kahoots as well. But we are going to talk about it about uh, later on, okay? Other things. So uh, let's go, go to this page, discover page, as I mentioned. So let's go to this page. It takes some couple of seconds. Mm -hmm. Let me see this one, okay. Here you are the page, uh, which you can find the games. Here are a lot of, uh, here you can get to know with the games, which is uh, popular gamers, some kind of, some will be, uh, I guess most of them are free. You can use for your classes. If you don't like these games, if you, are, if you think that these are not appropriate to your class, teacher use different books. And if you write the names of your book, you can find the activities which can be appropriate to your book. Let's imagine I'm going to use Hathaway. This is which is very popular. And let's see, uh, the, there, is there any uh, activities uh, for Hathaway? You can write Hathaway. What level are you are looking for? If you want, you can specify, or let's say unit one. Mm -hmm. And search. Just head away. Let's see first head away only. So as you can see here, there are a lot of games like uh, for headway. Headway beginner one to five. Headway elementary. Anything you can uh, you can find everything for your levels. This is very great function which you don't need to work. You just take this and play with your students, make fun, and that's all. That's great option, I think, the, to offer to teachers. And here, let's get to know this page uh, well, okay? Uh -huh. So uh, let me explain this one. So here you have to select, you can actually the American subject, like English art, if you are teaching the, the subject in English, have more filters which can be specified to your content. Or if you don't want to have this kind of options, you can clear from here. Okay, this is for clearing everything. And as you can see here, you can search any top, any the quiz which is appropriate to your content. And uh -huh, so we'll get to know with this site. And now uh, here also you have, you can see the only, 
most relevant ones uh, to your uh, search. If you write headway, it will not show you kind of uh, the things about the ocean or other things. Okay, it's, it shows you to get relevant to your content. This is also brilliant function of this site. And now time to get to know this uh, these buttons. See your split attach and these small buttons. If you like, if you play this one and like it, you like this one, uh, you can add, you can add it to your favorite ones with this how with the help of this star or. Here are the very important things we have. If you if you click this, if you click this one, if you click this button, three dots, you will appear three things like play, edit, and duplicate. Or even you can even you can complain about your game about this game if you think. The content of this game is not appropriate to educational purposes. If you find such things, you can complain the, about them to the website, and they can consider to your complaint, and they will work, and they will kind of uh, reduce or give limitations to the, that feature. So let's talk about play. We'll talk about a bit later on, okay? And we'll learn now how to edit and how to duplicate now. So and. So as I mentioned that play, I will show that at the, at the, at the end of, and at, at a bit later on. Just now we'll learn about edit and duplicate. For to edit this one, you can uh, you cannot edit right now because this is not your work. This is not your Kahoot. You should uh, you should first copy this Kahoot. To copy, you have brilliant function called duplicate. You can duplicate and you can edit it. Okay. Now let's see. Now let's. Push this one. What happens? Let's see. Uh, I push. I click the edit button, but it, I couldn't. It couldn't let me to edit. I just duplicate, and then I can uh, edit this one. I will show you in a couple of seconds. So it is going to ask me. Yep. Yeah. As I mentioned about, uh, it is asking me. As you don't have editing right because it's not your work, you should duplicate this one. First, duplicate, and then you can do whatever you want to. You want to do this one. Okay, you should click this button, duplicate. Okay, that's all. That's it. Here, you can see the name, duplicate. You can change this, you can delete this duplicate name. You don't need to worry about this. You can make yours. No, this is very simple. And no one can complain about you. This is you are taking my work and etc. Okay, no, you don't have problem. You have they have a premium version. So now uh, time to work uh, and you can change it. Here the, there is a small button called you can duplicate. Like if you work on uh, PowerPoint slides, this is almost entirely similar to PowerPoint. You can duplicate from here by right? click duplicate from here. You can, oh, okay, as you can see here, duplicated. The, the same question will be duplicate, and you can edit that question. Or you can just delay that question from this button. It asks you, okay, do you, do you find this right? How, how I deleting? Here on the very right side, left side, you will see this right button here. Uh, please, participants, look at the small icons here, very small icons here we have. Um, you will find there to duplicate and to delay them. Okay, please pay attention to that side. It's very important. And now, so now I'm going to delay this question. I don't need this question. I just accept this one. Uh, yes, delay this one. Or if you have, if you if you want to complain, and if you have, uh, for example, let's say this is about, uh, oh my, oh my gosh, this is a lot of questions here. Thirty questions, thirty questions is too much for the students. They can be bored, get bored. So let's say, I you need that you can select the questions to get to know with their content, or you just, you just delay them from the twenty or from the fifteen. It's up to your test. You can do whatever you want to do. Okay, by this one you can delay it and you can. Reduce the number of questions, or you can add questions if you wish. Okay, here. But I'm going to explain this side 
a little bit later on because uh, how to create the same with creating this is almost entirely similar with creating. So uh, we have to come back. And also you have to, you don't remember to save this one. Okay, we don't need, no, not going to save, okay. So you, you learn it, right? How to find the games. Let's see the subjects here. Here are the subjects, maths. If you are using maths, elementary maths like this, there are a lot of subjects you can use for this. Science, biology, chemistry, physics. It uh, finds you to the appropriate topics for quizzes, Kahoot to your content. And language art, which is great for us, for as English teachers. You can find the spelling vocabulary by clicking this and spelling in vocabulary. Uh, if you want to do something with grammar, you're welcome to use grammar. Or if you want to do something with literature and drama, which is very authentic to learners, which can be useful to develop their communication skills, I strongly recommend to use, to use this button, to click this button as well. And, you, and the next thing you have to do is apply. After, of course, uh, choosing your content. Okay, you should just apply that, so. And it's applying and it's again searching. It sometimes cannot find the content, can, cannot find the things which is, can be possible to your content. That's why I'm not strongly recommend you to do customize this one. Just leave it as, as default. Uh, with this, you can get uh, huge options and then you can choose yourself. It depends on you, on your taste, of course. I, I show you both of, them, both of them. And here's the most re uh, relevant and you choose the most played, of course, and the highest quality. If you want something very great thing, you are welcome to choose this one, highest quality. And the games will be very high quality and they will be kind of, they will be like, you may like them. Okay, we get to know with this page. Uh, I think um, everything I clearly explained you, I hope. And then now we are going to, again, we have to come back to our panel, which we are controlling the website now. So here again, we have to come back to Kahoot say, section. And we were in, this is about, this is discover page, discover here, right? We are in the now discover page and we are going to switch Kahoot page, okay? Here, the Kahoot page. So now we are going to move. If you are following with me, Please try to do, follow with me to learn about this site. So, and we are going to Kahoot page. Mm -hmm. So let me explain you quickly about this page. As you as you all know, here the also a sidebar. You have to you can control your all the things we, which will appear here, and what else? And you can upgrade your uh, live uh, your page like. To pro, pro your like uh, we can update your I mean the uh, you can pay actually you should pay if you want to have other options but you don't it is basically you don't need to do this uh, it's almost free and here you will be Kahoot your Kahoots and you, if you want to use some of the awesome school school of awesome like there you can collaborate with your students with your teachers you can make create one Kahoot and share with other teachers you are welcome to share with here. And the, your favorites will be in this section. And the next thing is about share it with you. With you. Okay, it's uh, that with me, it means you. Someone if shares with you something link with the help of link through, uh, throughout the Telegram or etc. doesn't matter. You will be, they will be here. And the something which is draft, which will, our draft is here because we don't save it yet. So now it's time to create Kahoot's and you, uh, you, you need to create Kahoot, you need two, fun, you, two buttons you will have. Uh, if you can see, this is a small button you have here as well. And here also very big button here, button here. You may choose any of them. It, they directed you to the one page. Okay, doesn't matter which one you are going to choose. So uh, let me choose this one bigger one because it is more visible than others. Mm -hmm. It's directing me to that site which where I can create Kahoot games. My own create Kahoot games and share with my uh, other teachers. If you really 
uh, want to create something. Wow, well, it's off for me. Milka fruit. Create and teach interactive lessons. This is other options, which can be premium. Okay, this is a button called premium. You cannot use them. You should for using them. You should pay something money about three or six dollars. But we don't need this one. We just need Milka fruit. We choose this one here. You can see right. Don't uh, worry. Don't like feel exhausted like money. It's not okay. Just create new yours. That's all. Create this one, and you will see this entirely similar page, which you can see in an edit page. So, and let me explain you quickly this page. Mm -hmm. So, uh, here the button add question. You can add questions to your website. And uh, if I man, uh, uh, before I mentioning that if you work with PowerPoint, it is similar to PowerPoint. You can customize with this sidebar. And here you can customize the time. You can work, you can choose the value of your question. You can two of two of three options. You can you can say it's not graded and you cannot give any point for this. You can you choose this one. Let me let me show you. If you push, if you click this way, you will see here. Here you will see. Uh -huh. Here you will see the oh, there it's not value. Here, as you can see, no value. And now going to, we're going, but it's not good. It's not fair to make it un, ungraded. Or you can say thousand, or you can say two thousand even. It depends on the question. If the question is very strong and a very difficult question, it can be take some time and it can work and they afford their huge effort. You can say two thousand or okay, two thousand. So if you, if you think it's okay, that's similar question, it's okay to give them 1,000, you're welcome. And here are the options. Ah, here are the first page, you are going to write your question. As you can as you can see this, click to start typing your question. Okay, uh, here you, sh you should write the question. And now we are going to, I'm going to sh show you how to type. This is just type question, what is this? And you can put the comma question mark and you can welcome to edit your questions like customize your question page questions and you can add the else something like this you can travel with this one as well and next thing which we are going to do this content to the question here you you are searching you can and this is a very uh, popular option nowadays becoming very popular among in computer users drag and drop option I strongly recommend you to use this drag and drop option. So how do you want to, how do you can do this? Let me show you. You should just click, uh, customize, uh, reduce the screen size. Go to this page, go to your desktop and choose image. Uh, let me find my image here all around. Yep, I found. Okay, drag, I drag the, the app. As you can see, I drag, drag it. And I'm going to put it on the side here. It's going to open and I drag and drop it here. Okay, this is a very easy function. Drag image and drop it. So one, two, three. Thank you, Kahoot, it's in. Okay, you can customize if you pay money, but you don't need to pay, that's just okay. This is also okay. Okay, well, let's see this is your content. Let's imagine you can put anything. Okay, if you don't like to take something from your laptop, you want to some take something from the, uh, from, the uh, from the internet, you're welcome. Just click this one and you will see the, uh, the pictures which you can upload to your, uh, to your question. So even so you don't like these pictures and you are, you are searching something new. Let's say cat or dog. You are welcome. And just search button. Push, click the search button. <clears throat> but uh, you should find here free ones. I guess you couldn't find because all are will be in the premium page. For this, you are you should pay some money. I guess. Okay. Let's reduce and choose something. Uh huh. Something shows all suggestions. I guess we couldn't find the free ones. You reopen and choose one of these. You can you can choose one of these, or you can drop it to your 
from your computer. Let's choose this one. Mm -hmm. Here you can see. <clears throat> okay, um, let's uh, add options. So let's say, what is this? Let's say dot or dots or cats or what is this? Um, line. Who can tell me what are they? Could you please tell me what are they? They are Hello? chickens. Chicken, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> chickens and uh, chickens. I'm joking. Thank you. And for you should choose. These buttons are uh, flying. You should click them. You should one of them. You should click. Okay. For this, you should just click this button, small button. Just click. It means that's correct. If you choose that this one. You can have you have two options. It means two correct answer, but don't leave it here if you think it's correct. In that case, it will be dogs. It's incorrect one. Let's choose this one and leave it like this. Okay, don't mention all this one. <laughs> In that case, students will be have a problem because and whatever they put they click, they will have it will be correct. Consider as a correct. So be careful with this one. Uh-huh. We we'll leave this one only and this. And this, this we don't need. And if you want, if you, if you, let's imagine you have two oh, correct. I think it is Sorry. If you have two options, and if you have, if you, let's imagine that you have two correct answers, I you also can do this. Yes. You can watch it after YouTube after me, please. Could you unmute mute yourself? Thank you. Great, and you can have multiple choice selection. Oh my, okay, you cannot have this option because it's in the premium page. You cannot have, you will have only one option. Okay, here. And now that's it, that's, this is the first question. And let's add another question. You have these options, uh, you have uh, two false, this is free. You can manage two false answer. But if you want do, if you want these options, you should, a bit, it's a bit in the premium page. So we have, we need, let's say true false in the next question. So we're going to, what uh, this, what is this video about? Okay, you should put a uh, question mark and you are welcome to customize your question, edit your question. You can make it bold like with the help of this button and, and you have to choose options. So first you, you need the video, right? I wrote in video. It means you can add video as well. For adding video, for adding video, you need this YouTube link. Okay, for Im images like photos, you can you need this one library or, you can even upload your from your uh, computer or PC or laptop. You're welcome to do this one. Uh, but if you want something video, you need this option, last option, YouTube link. Just click this one and you will see this one. It's explaining you what to do. This is three steps. It takes three steps. First, you should find the video. What video are going to do to show your students or others? You should click this YouTube button here. You don't need to search it, uh, YouTube. You just Click, and then you should take the uh, uh, take the copy of link, and then paste it here. Let's take some video from YouTube right now, and we will see how we can take this link. So let me go to the YouTube now. Mm -hmm. I'm going to the, go to the YouTube by clicking the YouTube link. Okay, let's imagine. Oh, wow, well, we are going to go here live. Let's choose this video. Sorry. Here you can hear the share button. Here, please pay attention. You can take the link from here or just directly from here as well. Okay, just clicking by here, you can also take the, this video share link. But this is actually the most uh, appropriate one. You can take different options with the different options. You just copy this one. Just click this one, copy, and it's copied. So 
close this one, close this page, you are in. And on your mouse, click the right button and you will see these options. And you have to push, you have to click paste button, which is called start in Russian, okay? Paste here. And that's it. The video is here. And you want to, <clears throat> you have, this video is about 10 minutes, let's say, or 20 minutes. And you don't want your students to watch full video. You want uh, your students to watch only some parts of video and you prepare a question only that part. In that case, you should know what part are you going to give. First, watch the video and decide what part are you going to give question. For this, you should customize. Let's say minute, it should start uh, minute two and it should end two to 20, 20 seconds. Or it can be, or not seven, let's say three. You, know, you have one minute and 20 seconds which students can watch and answer your question. And then you can should put, click this add button here in the very below. And then, okay. And then we have to create the questions here. True or false, what do you think? Oh, okay, you should change the question because it's about true or false. You may change. Uh, it's about, it's, it's up, totally up to you how to create the question. Don't pay attention to my content. Let's say this is true, okay? You are doing the true or false answer questions. So this is about uh, creating the questions. And now I'm going to show you very quick and a very easy way to import questions from your uh, Excel file. For this one, for this one, you need this import screen sheet page. Okay, even you can import slides, but it is in premium. But uh, import uh, spreadsheet is free. You can use this function, okay? If you are not seeing, please pay attention. This is very below on the left corner you will see here split share. Okay, this is not, this is paid. We don't need this one. I also don't need this one. Okay, let's go to import split sheet. Again, pop-up will appear on your screen. Again, explaining you what to do. First, let's download our template, it paid. Okay, download the template, get to know with it, and you can, you are <clears throat> welcome. So if then when you, create the question when you read it, when your questions is ready, you should feel, you should save it as Excel, okay? This is a format. You, know, you don't need to change this format. If you change, you cannot upload your uh, document to the web website. It is very simple. No, don't worry, it's very simple. And the one more important thing is here, the size of the document. Don't add pictures to your site. If you add the pictures, it could be uh, more than one megabyte and you cannot um, drag and drop it here or you cannot import it here. Okay, so, and, and now we are going to choose download template. So it's downloaded here. <clears throat> you see, right? Uh, I, I think you can see this one downloaded here. Please pay attention. Here you can find the template. After clicking this one, uh -huh, this is a first and it appears second. Is it clear, right? This is the first one and this is the second one. When you click this one, you will see this. Okay, then click this button, this open in this Excel format. It's opening. This is very easy way if you have a lot of questions, if you are going to import all your questions, this is a very simple and very easy way to do so. Uh, it takes your time. Uh, it's not taking your time. It's, it helps you to reduce your time limit. So I just click this page. We don't need this page just now. And get to know. It's giving examples. First, you, don't, you should delete these questions or you just leave it. And then when you come back to Kahoot, you can delete this as well. Here, the first thing is question. This is a number of questions. As you can see here, are the number of questions, how much question you can. You can only import 100 questions. If you are using it for uh, summative assessment, that's, that's great. You can use, you, have, you can give 100 questions if you wish. This is a limit. And then here is a question. You should write question like this. What is this book about, okay? just put uh, 
here and no 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 not, not there just here comma and not comma question mark and then you should write answers which is simple let's say dog i like really like domestic animals let's say cat or let's say something lion it's not domestic of course and let's imagine this could be what could be fish let's say fish okay <clears throat> and then uh, this is a time limit okay this is about time these are these are your options and this is about time you should set the time and if you are seeing this one you have you can copy this one just if you please pay attention if it's if this icon will be short let's here you should click this very small line like this weight this page these dots uh-huh it will be appear like uh, plus but plus icon then you can copy and you can draw it in the in the below to the below okay that's it you have 30 seconds all to all your questions and if you want to edit them just write 30 words 35 doesn't matter if you can write anything or if you don't want to write uh -huh, okay now uh, you can just customize it here here because it has kind of formula yeah you should give 20 seconds you can give uh -huh, 30 seconds you can customize it with this way also and then when you come back you can customize the time okay and so where is this uh, important thing is here you you have to open the word document here you have to prepare if you have a question on a word document you know, let's imagine such questions you have final test uh, grade 10 you just copy and paste them to the uh, to the office sheet excel sheet and you will take the, this one from your students let me show this one okay first you have to take questions okay just click them and on, on your mouse click the right side and you will see this uh, pop up uh, i pop up and you will choose only copy okay copy this page copy not start where is it copy not cut copy okay just copy and go to your browser go to your browser here your browser every uh, if you are using seven <coughs> or windows uh, or 10 doesn't matter you will have the same uh, window with me if you have you have to go to your browser uh -huh. you have to go to your browser and choose that page and close it oh no 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 not browser sorry i'm sorry so, uh, you have to go to your excel format you are importing the questions to excel click this and again on your mouse click right button and you will see this icon and here the two second option you can choose this one that's it the pure your question is here and now time to put the answers here if you want you can write or if you can do the same with your questions let me show this one is quickly mm -hmm. this is prepared let's say this one mm -hmm. just copy as I can on, on your mouse, control this one and go to your Excel and click this button next to your question. And again, click your mouse and put it here. Okay, you will have this, you may have such things, such experience like this one. And that time you have to come back. That's not good. For this, yeah, for this you should click Control and Z to not come, to come back and again you should come back to your word document and here you should customize if you have two space here you see this is a, there is a two space please pay attention there is two space there is two space that's why it, it is in the two box in the fact two boxes so i'm going to explain how to do this one i'm going to show you so here is a two set space and i go i'm going to delete i'm going to remove one space and the next space as well. Here also two space. You can see it should be one space between the options and just delete this one. And you will have these. You can mention them and on your mouse copy, go to this Excel 
and paste it here. That's it. That's it. Your participants, you see here, we have all options on their places. And you can set the time. Uh, and here, the one more very interesting, very important thing, you have to mention the, which one is correct. If you choose, if you say one, it means this one is correct. Okay, the first option, this is the answer one. It means this one is correct. You, you get it, right? If you write here one, it means one. If you click it, if you write here, <clears throat> let's write four, but um, this is answer four. It means it consider this one as four is correct one. Okay, it, and the program understood you like this way. And then you have to save it. To save this document, you should go to this uh, very, about, uh, very about, you will see this file. Uh, you should click this one. And here we have a lot of options. So from here, uh, dear participants, please look at the very, very about called save as button or just save if you if you know the where this document can locate. This is the location of the document. You can find the document from here. It shows you the location of the document, but I'm going to change it the location. That's why I'm choosing save as. I also strongly recommend you to choose this one. Save as, not this one, okay? This is good. And after clicking this, the pop-up will be appeared. It's going to appear. Yep, thank you, it's appeared. Here you can, you can change the location of the file. You, as you can see here, you can change, right? Here, in, with the help of this button. You choose on variable and I'm going to choose desktop, but you're welcome to choose any, any, any place you, in, your, in your PC. So it doesn't matter. I'm going to choose it uh, on my desktop and I'm going to name it uh -huh, demo two. I have demo one, so let's say I have demo two. And uh, and please, 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 don't click this button. You don't need to change that. Some people has assumed that if you if you save as like this, as if you click you know, if you save it as this way, uh, Excel 197 and 2003, it will be saved all the things. Some most people assume like this way, but it's not correct for Kahoot. It's correct, but it's not good for Kahoot. You should choose. You should choose only Excel, or you don't, you don't need to take, you don't need to touch this one. Just leave it as a default. Then push and click this save button and it will be saved. Okay, and you can find it on your desktop. You can, I'm going to go to my desktop and it will be somewhere here. So it takes some time. What is this document? Yep, demo two. Here is a demo two, and I'm going to upload to my uh, this one to this page. Okay, just I'm going to drag and drop. Let's try this function. Drag. Not here. Here can be. Is it imported? Oh, sorry, no, it's not important, but we import it from here. Ah, we have to drag and drop here. I'm so, sorry, you have to drop it here. Okay, this is uh, this one. Ah, okay, as you can see, the, like, you can drop it here. Or if you think it's difficult, uh -huh, you can choose a, choose a file. Just open select file. If you think it's a bit advanced and choose your desktop and search demo two and open. Okay, button, open button. So you are, your file is in, okay, the size is here. Okay, it's two questions, it's very small size. You can upload it. And the next thing is you are going to do is, this is upload button. Just upload it. And if you want to add question, you can add, you're welcome. If you don't, just leave it here. Uh, upload, yep, and then add questions, yes. Here is our questions. Yeah. Yeah, do you get it? What is this book is about? I wrote it before. Here is the questions, uh, answers. 
here also we have another question something yeah smart handsome can you remember this this is the first question which we create on the excel so this is a very simple way and when you're done please save it if you leave it it will be in your draft and you cannot find your draft from your draft it's a good way to save it or if before saving you can review it from this one you can review yourself with your phone or i'm just not going to do this i'm just going to save it it's not uh, i have to give yep i'm going to give title so let's say demo two and description you if you are welcome to write descriptions here uh if you want to clean it clear to your students and here that's language you can choose english other language i don't know uzbek as well i guess there is uzbek i, I think no okay and that branding if you want to brand yourself that's okay make visible on everyone to click visibility please it should be everyone okay in that case uh, the, your students cannot be see you that's it and you just click done it's saving and then done button again i guess i think yes, yes we are done Mm -hmm. Welcome here, the second demo which we created. And now we are going to, I'm going to quickly show you how to play with your students. If you are, uh, if you are in the channel, you can find how to play this one as a teacher, as a live. But now I'm going to show you how to play as a challenge as you, how you can assign it to your students and your students can play it the time when, uh, which can be appropriate to, to their sellers. Okay, you can set the dates. Uh, this is a due date till when they should, uh, they can play and time as well. And create the link which you can share with them. And it's going to create. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, previous um, demo, I will show you uh, Google Classroom. You can assign it Google Classroom or these platforms as well. And you, if you want to use it on your, on your Telegram, just click this button, copy URL, copy, it's copied and send it to your group. That's it. And they can play and you will, you will see their results here in the report uh, section. When they play this game, you and the, and the Answers will be appeared here. Their answers uh, here will be question, difficult questions. You can uh, know how what questions are difficult for them, and you should uh, dip, uh, you should give extra information about the question or extra explanation of these questions you can give. Or if they need help, it will be appeared here. If some of them done, didn't finish, you will see this also. This is a uh, big picture. It, this website gives you the full picture of your students how they are progressing on your course um i'm sorry guys uh, i'm sorry dear participants uh, i think uh, i time is not allowed me to explain you quizzes am i right if you have a questions please write uh, or tell ask me i will try to help do my best to answer your questions any uh, any questions any anything you which which is not uh, clear for you you're welcome to ask here right now. Okay, dear teachers, how many of you managed to create any game on Kahoot? I can see that Feruza Sabirova is writing, yes. Okay, Feruza has created. Who else? Mm -hmm. Maybe we will ask Feruza to share her screen. Okay. And Shaknoza Uzokova created great. Firuza, can you can you share your screen? We will see. Yeah, yeah. Just a second. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then Shaknoza Uzakova, you will share as well. Okay, get ready. Okay. Mm -hmm. ready. But but I couldn't upload the templates because I had no enough time at that time. 
No, it's okay, okay, it doesn't matter. You, you can okay. practice afterwards, but now okay. uh, I will just I, I would like just to see how can you somebody manage. join uh, add me to the Zoom, please. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just a second, I will give you back. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can see your so <laughs> No? Good. Yes. Yeah. We can see. Yeah. Can Where see? was it? Yes. So, in the so. Mm -hmm. It's okay. It's okay. That's great. great. Yeah. Hiruza, you, you can... are doing well as usual. Great. Yes. With this link, you can they join at kafu.it. With this link, the students can join. Uh, if you have uh, some questions, you can uh, see the video about this on the channel. Because mm -hmm. this is a very big program. It takes uh, not uh, one an hour is not enough for this, I think. Uh, mm -hmm. I try to cover yeah. all the things. That's why uh, mm -hmm. it takes more time. OK, now what about Chaknozes? Jahangir, please allow her to share her screen, please. Yeah, they can. But first, this. Uh, Slom John Sobirov is it cheering, right? Slom John, so, great, good Piruza, job. Piruza Sobirova, yeah? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Piruza, please, can Stop. you remove? Yes, mm -hmm. thank, thank you. you. Now, Shaknoza Uzakva, please share. Just a second. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But mine is ready one in the last step. I didn't... No, it's okay. Just copy the URL. You can send your students, right? You 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 understand, right? What's going on there? Yes, of course. Thank you. Very, that's that's very the point. Good. Yeah, that's the point. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. This link you can share with your students in Telegram or Facebook. Doesn't matter. Uh, whatever you use, even you can send uh, while via SMS. That's mm. it. And you can upload it to your uh, Google Classroom if you are using Google Classroom, Teams, Facebook, etc. That's that's great. Thing, great, great. First, you have to have classes on the. Yeah, you have right. Wow, great! That yes, yes, that one. Great. Choose this one, and it will be assigned to the your students. Yeah, customize it. Thank you so much for helping me to, to show this page as well. Great. Yeah, I hear the car food. That's great. That's it. That's great. You learn it. That's great. Click OK or X. OK, something like this. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, I, I understand. That's great. In the Zadania, it will be in the Zadania, in the assignments or classroom. Thank you for sharing. Oh. So um, that, that's all, I guess, right? Okay, now thank mm -hmm. you very much for your attention. Thank you very much, Jahangir, for clear cut explanations. Uh, we very what? hope that all the oh. teachers here will use their Kahoot in their future classrooms. Jahangir, you want to say something? Yeah, Ulubek is going to share us. Let's see. He's Ooh, as well. Ulubek is sharing. Yes. Uh huh, great. Good job. The picture yeah. is here on the place. That's great. Mm -hmm. That's, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's that's great. Yeah, correct answer, incorrect answer. Yes. Yeah. You know, teachers, what is very captivating here? Kahoot has its own music, which can attract most students more because while they are playing, they can dance under this music as well. Please encourage them to dance under this music as well. In this case, it can 
get uh, more interesting for them. Uh, and what is very good in this Kahoot game is you can play it with your students online and offline. Okay, so if you are uh, using this game online, please ask them always to have extra device. It's better. Okay. Now, thank you very much, Ahangir, for your clear cut explanations. Thank you. And I very hope that all the teachers here will be waiting for your next weekend's webinars, workshops as well, right? But stay tuned, guys. Uh, we have all the webinars and interesting workshops during the week as well. And Jahangir will have his solo, uh, I mean, the explanations of tech tools at the next weekend as well. Thank you very much for your attention. Jahangir, everybody um, is thanking you here in chat. Great job. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you all. Goodbye. Thank you all. Bye. Bye.